Alrighty, well, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, well, um, earlier today, uh, I didn't stream. I didn't do my usual pinball stream. Uh, just, I had some bad sleep, so didn't really have the, um, didn't really have the get up and go to do any pinball. But sometime after that, though, I found out that this game, Capcom Fighting Collection, has just dropped. So. So, um, I went ahead and just, uh, downloaded and installed and all that. Um, but I'm not gonna play, I'm not gonna play this that long. Just enough to give, uh, give people a little bit of a taste. And, um, going forward, until further notice, I probably will be, I probably will be shelving pinball for the time being. And gonna be, uh, streaming this game. But right now, this is just gonna be a little game, gameplay sample. And the main the main reason why I got this game Super Puzzle Fighter Turbo. This was a game that I played the living Super hell out of back in the 90s. Turbo. Start there. Uh, no random select. Otherwise, I don't care. Uh, I'll just pick him. That's what I want. I want random select. So, actually, let me up. Actually, let me bail out of this and um, show people how to actually play this game. Super oh, this. Fighter 2 Turbo. There should have been a... Whoops. I guess there isn't. But basically, it works like Tetris. And whatever matches you get, get sent over to your opponent. Now, the, the circle gems blow up all, uh, blow up all gems of that color. <laughs> and if you notice, you put, uh, gems of the same color together, they form a bigger gem. If you look on the right, if you notice the um, notice the numbers in some of the blocks, when that countdown ends, they all become normal blocks. And this this diamond here. Destroys all gems of whatever color it lands on. So. Yeah. 
Whoops. Here comes the comeback. Here comes the comeback. Take longer. But here we go. I couldn't take her off quick enough, so she's gonna come back and I'll probably end up losing. Wrong one. Anyway, um, but yeah, that, like I said, I played the crap out of this game back in the 90s. Gem, gem, gem. So, whoops. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, quick save it. And I forgot to mention, too, I still have my, um, uh, my Final Fantasy 14 blog post that I have to get posted up as well, so... So one of the reasons why I'm going ahead and making this video now is just so I can actually post on my blog. Hey, I got this game, and you know, and all that. So, that's a bail out of that. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be a brand spanking new one. Uh, but uh, it seems the, uh, the big game that everybody's into is Vampire Savior. The only one I ever seen was the very, very first Darkstalkers. It's basically a Halloween-themed Street Fighter. So... Vampire Savior, the Lord of Vampire. Capcom! Oh, she didn't do it on that one. Dirty Beret. Cool! Random select! I don't want turbo, I am just gonna pick normal. And I believe this is a it's a six button fighter. So and I forgot to check and see if there's a trading mode on this. Okay, I guess it wasn't blocking. Oh wow, that just goes right into the next round, cool. I like this. The round trans the the round transitions are like super quick. The demon realm beckons.
Yeah, I like that. Oh, that's a long range throw. Oh, so much for me. This game has a training mode. Uh, ew, uppercut. Half circle back. Oh, it's got a uh, three. It's got that 360 crap. That's a controller mangler. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> it's got a butt bounce. Damn. But like I said, I like that. Transition's almost immediate. Like I said, I just wanted to do a quick gameplay sample on this, so, but like I said, going forward, I'm going to be shelving pinball, so, shelving pinball and switching to this, so. Let me go ahead and quick save that. Oh, damn, you only get one single slot. Okay, so, I guess I kind of messed that up. Wow, wow. All right, so, so that'll do it. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate that, and I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.